Preparation for severe weather is important, but the response to the aftermath is just as vital. A lack of drinkable water can mean the difference between life and death for a community. News Channel 11's Terry Craig reports on Greenville's water crisis. Schools closed, businesses closed, the streets of downtown Greenville empty. Why? Well, the town doesn't have any water. There's no water in the Greenville water system. That's Greenville Mayor Cal Doty. He spent the day with volunteers handing out cases of water at the Greenville Municipal Airport. In the aftermath of Hurricane Helene, town leaders realized the pumping station that supplies water to the majority of Greene County had been damaged. Our water commission is working hard to put together a plan to address this issue. This issue. The plan is to install new pumps, but it could take time. Doty says the hope is to get residents water back within the next week. There's eight pumps coming in that will be put into the river as soon as we can get down there. Because of the flood, there's sludge and other things where they're having to try to get down to the pump house. The airport, South Green High School, and the Camp Creek Volunteer Fire Department are just a few of the water distribution sites across the city. City Manager Todd Smith says volunteers from across the region are working tirelessly to provide Greenville with water. We looked at the videos of uh, all the, de the destruction and devastation we saw on Friday and Saturday uh, and you think you're defeated. Today you see the people come out and support the community and you know you've won because we are going to take care of each other. As the process to restore water continues, Doty reminds residents to stay patient. We are where we are. So be kind to your neighbors and if, if, if you get in a line and you're, it's going to take a while to get through it, so be patient. In Greenville, Terry Craig, News Channel 11. Thank you, Terry. You are looking at a full list of water distribution sites in Greene County. It's on your screen right now. You can also visit our website, WJHL.com, for more information.